How's it going guys? In today's video, we're going to be going over how we can create an action sheet dialogue and it's going to look like this. So right here we have a button and a text view. And when we click on the button, we're going to get this action sheet appear from the bottom and we can pick a few options such as good, average or bad, or we can even cancel the action. And we also have a small title up here. So there's plenty of good stuff we can do with this action sheet. Let's go ahead and click on good for example and it's going to place it right inside there. We can also go ahead and click on bad if we want and it will select that option. So that's what we're going to be making in this video. And to get started, go ahead and create a new project in Xcode. So the first thing we want to do inside here is go ahead and create three variables and they will all be modifying the state. So we need to include the at state keyword. So private var is showing will be the first one. And this one will control whether the action sheet's being displayed or not. Now we can go ahead and create add state private var text, which will be set initially to three dots. And one more private var, which is going to be a cola, which is initially set to cola dot black. So the next thing we're going to do is go ahead and inside the body, create a V stack with some spacing which will be set to 20. And inside there, the first thing we have to create is a button that says rate us. And it depends on what you want to show the user. I'm just going to pretend they want to rate the app. So inside here, we'll go ahead and type in is showing dot toggle because we want to show the action sheet when the user clicks on this button. Now it's actually very simple to create this dialogue. All we have to do is go ahead and include confirmation dialogue. And like that, we're going to have a title key. And inside here, all we have to do is specify the title of the dialogue. So we can say, how did we do? Then we can go to is presented. And inside here, we can add the is showing at state binding variable. And it's also going to allow us to provide the actions, but we're just going to delete that because instead I want to go ahead and include the title visibility, which will be set to dot visible. Now we can go ahead and include the buttons inside here. So the first button is going to be an option that says good. And the text is going to be modified to good. And the caller will be modified to dot green. Now we're just going to go ahead and copy and paste this twice. So one, two. And inside here, we'll go ahead and say average followed by average and dot yellow. Then we have bad followed by bad and dot red to stress that it is a bad result. And finally, outside of this confirmation dialogue closure, we're going to go ahead and provide a text, which will just be the text with a foreground color of the color. So now we can even go ahead and play the app inside the live preview and it's going to give us the same result. So if we click create us, it's going to give us this dialog box at the bottom. We can click on average or we can even click on bad and whatever we click on, the changes will be reflected on the UI so we can use it however we please. If we go ahead and click on rate us and click on cancel, nothing's going to happen. So everything's working perfectly. But that's actually all I wanted to show you in today's video. So as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.